question. We gotta see how loud it is, but Tom Maximus has a question. <laughs> this is students from New York, upstate New York, Geneseo, college students. Wow. When they when they take when they take the report and they charge something against you for like being on whatever like property, like what what did they specifically charge you with? They charged me with like tres trespassing? with trespassing. And uh, that's it. Yeah, trespassing. That was it. Yeah. Okay. All right, that was good. Let's go. So, what is it? What is oh. it that these like local officials and like legislative bodies, and, like the judicial system, have to gain from siding with them rather than like the citizens? Well, most the community? of them own land, and they, most of them are leased to the industry. The, so the people in uh, in the in judicial office? in okay. the office in uh, most of them in the office, most of them the judges, uh, the lawyers. So they're all part of uh, this system to keep it going, and then maybe they're afraid. You know, they're afraid of being against a multi-billionaire, multinational companies that have hundreds of attorneys to protect them. Yeah. So I'm going to do bad lip reading later with some of this. Oh, hi, kitty, kitty. Aww. It's one of the barn cats, probably. The school district, the high school near that Cricket Valley, is yeah. putting an air monitor so they can do a before the power plant goes in and after the power plant. Oh, very good. Comparing. That's very good. Yeah, Dutchess County is going to, I would think, is going to protest a large power plant. But the, um, Should we adopt her? Tony, Tony uh, Ingrafia <laughs> had said that the, the but it might power be plant will use 150 wells. 150 wells per what year? Per year. Yeah. Per year. So, um, so, at the power plants, they just burn the gas they're taking from here and turn it into turn electricity. electricity. Yeah. We do have one small power plant. So far, they're planning on putting in about six small ones that are about six, 250 megawatts. So we do have that. We have one already built. One is being proposed. <clears throat> so that will also start to build up. This constant build up in the infrastructure. It's one thing after another. Then they'll be introducing uh, other industries that need this type of gas. It could be a cracker plant to make plastics. So we have cracker plants going in now in western Pennsylvania near Pittsburgh. So you have all these things going on. It's a very expansive, invasive industry. So once they get a footing, they just fill up everything. It's just going to be one industry after another that needs this that comes out of the earth. So we need to find something that's not going to pollute, that's not going to put us at risk. Because if anything, there's a leak and an explosion, we are at tremendous risk. Yeah. And people can be hurt. And we've had explosions throughout the country where people have been hurt. So uh, we don't want this near our homes. Were there explosions in Wyoming? I don't know. We'd have to look it up. But I know they have earthquakes out yeah, west. Yeah. So they've had that. What sorts of effects? We had a western Pennsylvania horrible explosion of a pipeline. Mm -hmm. And there was a man living in a house maybe a thousand feet from it. And he got burnt most of his body. He survived. But he's, he got burnt. What sorts of effects?